Palestinian protests, Home Secretary. I was astonished uh, when I read the Home Secretary's article in the Times uh, newspaper. I think her behaviour over the last uh, few weeks has been behaviour that is uh, irresponsible. Her article in the Times was incorrect and uh, inflammatory. At a time when senior politicians should be bringing communities together, uniting people who have differences, instead she is, is stoking divisions. Uh, and, and I worry, as a consequence of her words and her behaviour, uh, you'll see this Saturday on Armistice uh, Day, the far right, EDL uh, and other like uh, people turning up. Across the country, I think we see people who are reasonable, who are moderate, and who would always want to support the police in making difficult um, decisions in difficult circumstances. Um, and that's what you get with an incoming Labour government if we're privileged to come in to serve. What you've got at the moment is the complete opposite. A Home Secretary who is divisive, who is stoking up tension at the very time that we should be trying to reduce tension and is undermining the police as they go into a very difficult set of operational decisions. So she is doing the complete opposite of what I think most people in this country would see as the, the proper role of a Home Secretary. But then that's compounded by the fact that we've got a Prime Minister who is too weak to do anything about it. That's the worst of all circumstances for so many people across the country. It's the worst of all circumstances from the police.